what's up cuties welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another video and another episode of life of kenyani so my girl here is at the hospital we are not even in a regular spot we are in a hospital bed She's still looking cute though, like, let's be for real, she's still looking cute, but she's in a hospital bed, and she is so worried right now, like, she is crazy worried, and the reason is because she woke up with, like, a lot of pain in her stomach, and so she rushed to the hospital, Nyla helped her and rushed her to the hospital, and they are going to put her on some Pitocin, and we're going to have to see how this goes after that. But I'm very, very, very nervous for my girl. But we're going to see. Hopefully, we're going to be good. But um, hopefully, we don't have to do no C-section, no emergency C-section. Hopefully, there's no baby distress and just go with a natural birth. So we're going to go ahead and see what happens. So Nyla is out Ooh, there right boy. now, but Hello, we are going to just see hey, what's going to go on. Okay, so she got the little tool stuff here. Oops. She's Good basically finale. telling us, Spinner. you know, you just be calm and uh, we're going to, you know, take. wipe the area. Make sure it's nice and clean. You have nothing to worry Ow. about. Ooh. That's me when I get needles, y'all. Like, uh-uh. Oh, my God. My poor girl. But yeah, she gonna be put on some Pitocin, y'all. Uh, today was supposed to be our little Sunday reset, you know, cleaning the house and, you know. Oh my god, look at the contractions kicking in, y'all. Oh my, my poor girl. We were really supposed to have a calm day today, like for real, for real. And then this happens, like, you really just never, ever know. But Nyla's sitting here. She got the hospital bag and everything with her. I'm so happy that Nyla's here because I don't know what we would do if she really was not here right now. But we're about to come in here and just make sure that my girl is doing fine. Uh, go me? Oh, Lord, this is just so crazy right now. We should go and, um definitely call up Janae. we definitely gonna call her up and be like girl like it is getting hectic in here like it's getting so hectic we gonna chat with her on the phone um it says worsened contractions from pitocin okay yanni is a warrior a vessel of life navigating the crucible of pain in the symphony of agony and in anticipation her spirit burned like a steadfast flame as the pitocin continued its dance within her veins her story unfolded one of endurance of raw beauty of someone braving the storm to bring forth a new dawn my girl's contractions got worse y'all my poor girl okay now things are getting difficult the pain uh, catches kenyani see this is why we pausing y'all Okay, <laughs> um, off guard every now and then, making simple things like sleeping or walking somewhat uncomfortable. She should try doing some early labor activities to help ease the pain. She's just so uncomfortable. What's this pain in Kayani's mouth? Oh my god, she probably has like a cavity or something. But we are supposed to go to the dentist tomorrow. I don't know if we still will. Hopefully not looking, um, hopefully not looking to help, you know, if we do give birth today. Hopefully Nyla can keep the baby, or maybe the baby's gonna have to stay in the hospital for a little bit. I don't know, but just how the how things are going right now, I feel like the baby, I feel like the baby is fine, but we probably gonna have to keep the baby here, y'all. And I don't want to. I want the baby to be with us. Oh, and by the way, I do want to thank y'all so 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 freaking much for all of the baby names. Like you guys are really like the goats okay the cutie goats period i appreciate y'all so much they be passing these pretzels around like it's nothing um is she gonna go talk okay she's gonna talk to caitlin i guess i kind of like that um nyla is here with us because like we are not cool with our baby daddy y'all know from the machinima if y'all did not check that out i will leave that down below for y'all in this video but we not cool with him so it's very nice that she's with us. We're gonna try and speed this up and see what really happens. Oh my god, Tanya. It is not a good time to be calling me right now. Like, really. It's not. We're going through it right now. Well, we're just gonna have to see the updates. 
why does everyone want to call? Oh, I guess because it was probably Nyla calling everybody. And, you know, the talk of the town. Miss Celebrity now. Oh, look at her getting paid. And she's in pain. We love to see. <laughs> so nervous for her. Uh, I hope there's nothing. Like, I literally just jumped from that from that pop-up just now because I thought it was just something like, you know. Hey, you've gotten pretty good taste. Girl, be for real. I'm so uh -oh. nervous, y'all. Oh my gosh, she's sleeping. <laughs> God, she's sleeping. <laughs> she, like that, that, the drugs got her. Okay. <laughs> she said, oh, she's not ready because she's in labor. Kayani knows it doesn't make sense, but the thought of giving birth is making her sad. This baby has been a constant companion of her of of her for so long and Kayani is not ready to not ready to part with them not yet she would like space oh my girl like she has so many negative moodlets it's almost time <laughs> okay so i guess that's good news because she's in active labor right now there's nothing wrong with the baby and we should be good to go i think it's just because she was getting dilated so uh, okay, so about time already. Um, the contractions are intense. Kayani feels the inside of her body is being lit on fire and ripped apart. Oh my god. She is done with this whole situation and ready to get it over with. Oh my god, we only have one more hour of this and we're probably going to be done. Oh my god, can we ask for the epidural? Because... How do I tell you? Oh my god, we cannot ask. <gasps> she about to go natural. Natural. 29 minutes, y'all. 29 minutes. She's worried about bad breath and everything. Can we go and wait downstairs? Nyla, you need to just wait downstairs because you're doing too much. Go and sit over there. Oh my god, I'm so... Nyla. Nyla, what are you doing? Girl! You're not... <laughs> She's not, why do they always do this in the hospitals though? I mean, go off, but like, let's be realistic. Let's be so realistic right now, girl, you're not doing that. Okay, so she is awake now and she's feeling just very uncomfortable. Let me see if she has any other moodlets about her. Oh, she's just feeling pain in her, um, in her tooth. Two hours later. Okay, so we just gonna be walking around with Nyla for a little bit, you know, and being a day in the life at the hospital with Nyla until it's five hours till my girl has to, you know, give birth to this baby. I wonder how she's feeling. She is supposed to be, no, that's not her. Is it her or Janae? I think it's Janae. That's the godmother or is it Nyla? I don't know, but they both about to be aunties, so... How my girl feeling? She feeling very confident. She's confident in this whole situation. She's like, yeah, my girl got it. Like, for real, for real. Um, do we even know Emmanuel? Let me see if we even know him. Yes, we definitely do. Let's go and chat with him a little bit. The baby is ready to come out. Kenyani is trying her hardest to focus on um, rhythmic breathing, but the pain is becoming more and more unbearable, and Kenyani is starting to doubt whether she can do this. Girl, it's too late. It is too freaking late. Girl, you have all this food in here. Spaghetti with meat. You got all this food. Salmon with veggies. You better eat this. Do not eat it. Do not eat it. <laughs> I wish there was a chair in here so that we could, like, sit here with her. But uh, she's so hungry. She cannot eat nothing. <laughs> My girl can't eat a damn thing. Complain about Sunday, she's going to be like, girl, I just wanted to, like, clean my house and file my taxes. <laughs> and now I'm, like, in this pain. I'm sitting in this bed just crying. Why this baby to come out of my damn stomach? Honestly, I get props to all the mothers out there. All the mothers. Especially the mothers that be going natural. Oh, my God. Okay, we just going to sleep. Yep, she just relaxing. Oh, y'all, I'm so not so ready for this. I'm so not ready for this. Y'all. 
A few moments later. This hospital is mad ghetto, okay? Mad ghetto, but it is time for us to give birth. Oh my god, I'm so, so nervous. She already took off the stuff. But if y'all don't know, y'all know what to do. Y'all want to see the uncensored version of this. Y'all will not be able to see her give birth in this video. So if y'all want to go and see her give birth, the only reason why I'm, I can't is because she's it's going to be showing everything. And I can't do that on YouTube. So y'all go over to my Patreon. If y'all are a um, Patreon cutie, y'all can get access to the uncensored version of her giving birth um over there so yeah i will see you guys over there so if y'all guessed it was gonna be a boy it is a boy y'all ah, we had a baby boy and like i was saying in my patreon video i'm really excited to have a boy because like i feel like it's always girls like we're always going through like the girls and stuff like that and by the way I don't think this is going to be Kayana's first child. I mean, only child. Um, so we're going to see if she has, like, you know, girls or if she's going to just be a boy mom. But I'm really excited. Like, we really have our baby now, y'all. Ah, I'm so excited. So I do need to get some more infant CC, but um, right now, this is how he is looking. Like, ah, look at him. Boy he is so adorable and my girl is in love now like she is so in love she is ready to nourish she is feeling the environment um she made a new friend when she's talking about her baby and she's cooking up some memories and stuff like that like she's really feeling great and it did say um in here that it took a bit of time but kenyani milan is now at peace with her child she will do her best to be a good parent to princeton oh yeah his name is princeton so thank you so much to um whoever suggested that name i will put you um up on the screen but yes his name is princeton and prince for short and um he's also very intense i feel like he would be intense an intense baby because kayani's whole impre um, pregnancy she was having meltdowns and breakdowns and stuff like that so i feel like it kind of suited it a little bit i was trying to hand him over but like it doesn't even look like that i can do that but we about to just play with him a little bit. Actually, we shouldn't really do the blow raspberry because he's a newborn, but it's fine. <laughs> um, I did also make him a little smaller as well, y'all. But we're probably going to just put him in the crib. I don't think he's hungry or nothing like that. No, he's not. So we're going to go and put him in the crib. I'm probably going to put him in here um just so that i could well she could like you know sleep with him for the couple for the next couple of days and we're definitely going to be doing a little uh like baby checkups and stuff uh, as well yeah, so we're definitely going to do that but she's going to talk to prince and look at him in his little crib he's the cutest and he has his father's skin tone oh, i just i just love it i love it i love it even though i don't love his father but it's fine um, we're gonna have Miss Auntie go and soothe him to sleep and do her auntie duties. My girl needs a bath after this, okay? She needs a good old bath. If she wanna play pick a -boo, leave the little baby alone. Okay, so she about to go and do that. She just had a whole baby, okay? She had a whole entire baby. Um, we're gonna go and kiss goodnight oh. as well. I wonder how he's going to be in the night and stuff, but she kind of has like the same little mood list, cooking up memories. Let me see how her relationship is. Oh, it's a little bit, it's a little there or whatnot, but she about to go to sleep. A well-needed bath. Um, we have this ugly crib right now and it's looking very ugly, but I, I didn't really want to have like the baby be like a baby like the object baby i really wanted him to be like a newborn an infant so that's why i ate him up really fast let me know if y'all like the name and stuff like that but yeah she is extremely exhausted we're gonna come in here 
and change our outfit been very like comfortable i don't want her to be doing too 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 much y'all and i kind of want this episode to be a little short as well just because i want to get into the baby you know stuff in the next episode but so we have a baby boy and we can finally put prince right above here i still kind of want to keep the theme that we have going on but she's gonna make her some coffee um for now should we just go on like right after birth and make her a little drink i think yes i think we definitely deserve it <laughs> we've been pregnant for man long we gonna have some hennessy huh we not doing no coffee. We doing the honey. Oh, look at her. She still got the little baby fat. Oh, her little coach right there. Um, also, I need to buy the um other things as well. Oh, she just likes this um, mixology. I need to buy the other stuff because she might start leaking. He see, heavy melons. Kiani is feeling uncomfortable and a little bit ridiculous as her breasts have become so engorged from not pumping for too long and they're starting to sag down low the sensation of fullness is making it difficult for her to move around without feeling like she's carrying around two heavy melons on her chest um oh and she's dangerously full okay so she really needs to pump so i'm about to go and get her one of those little pumping things and also some other little um baby things to help her um, milk flow so I did purchase some things for her. I got this Tylenol, I got the cookie, the lactose cookies, and her pump, and I also got a formula as well if we can't give um, Prince, you know, any breast milk, but I do definitely want to give him like, oh my god, wait, it's the princess baby Prince, oh my god, I'm going to put it over here, can I put it over here, oh my god, no I can't, okay, let's just put it... We're going to put this in her room. We also got his little certificates. How freaking cute. Um, why is it so big? Like, why can't I just, like, put it in here? We're going to put this in her room as well. We'll just put it right there for now. Until I figure out where I really want to put them. Oh, I also did add her little maternity pictures, y'all. I didn't tell y'all, but these are the maternity pictures. They came out so adorable like she definitely ate i was going for the black the black and white ones because it just looked a little bit better but yeah did she actually end up having the alcohol y'all i don't even know but hopefully she didn't because that would have been bad we about to pump the i think it's the left side that's really painful for her oh i don't know now okay well she about to go and pump right now Prince is with his his auntie sleeping. Sunday reset was awful. Well, I duh, because we had a damn baby. Like, hello. Um, but we about to go and throw these stuff out real fast. Okay, so she pumped the left side. So we got our little thingy right there. Um, and we're probably gonna do the right side just because we do not want, you know. Um, so we got a little quirk revealed. Oh, he sneezes a lot for an infant. Oh, his little nose is sneezing, y'all. Oh, my baby hungry. Is my baby hungry? Um, watching over my. But you don't even know what money is. Awake and angry. Oh, he's in an angry mood. You sound just like your mama. Oh, it's not really showing anything, okay? That's a good thing. <laughs> but yeah, so we're gonna pump that and we're gonna put these in the refrigerator. It is 2 a.m. Yeah, we got home at like 10 something. But we're going to pick him up and give him little kisses. I can't believe she is a mother. Be I'm a mother. No drama. Okay. No drama. I am a mother. I'm a mother now. Oh, my baby, baby. Wait, does she have like this bra on because of her pumping? If so, oh wait, no, that's a part of the mesh. <laughs> I thought I thought it was like a little addition or whatever. But he was angry, but now he's all good. He's he's a very calm baby. Like we really don't have to do too much. <laughs> But 
She also was losing her stardom, y'all, because she hasn't been, you know, gossiping on the news and whatnot. But she is too uncomfortable to do anything. So we're just going to chill. She got this toothache. Um, and unpleasant surroundings. Let's go and put this away. We really need to do, we really need to clean up though, like, so bad, but. Oh, baby, now, you guys. Ah, I'm gonna eat one of these cookies. She's feeling so happy, though. Like, she's feeling so inspired, like, more inspired than ever. I love that for my, and I wanted to go on, like, the, um, the interwebs. I think we can do it now, though. We're gonna do this oh, real quick. Just chill a little spinet. bit. Because, you know, newborns don't really do much. They just hungry all the time, Good sleep, nubby. or just need some, a little bit of attention. So, they don't really need too much right now. But, should we send an email to Ramel? Be like, if you wanted to come and see. Yeah, we're gonna send him a little, a little email and be like, if you want to come and see your son, then you can. But, I ain't forcing you to do anything. Mm. Because if you don't want to be in the child's life, then you can go somewhere with that. Okay. First, stardom to, like, still, like, be up there. So, um, Starlight Sim Weekly. Rumors that, rumors state that Emmy star, a famous celebrity actor from Bridgeport, may have a secret love child named Alexa star with a boyfriend. Oh. Maybe a DNA test will be, oh. That's the tea, though. <laughs> We gotta pay these bills. Y'all, we gotta pay these bills. Hold on. Pay these bills. Pay apartment rent, please. And we gotta pay the utility bills. We gotta pay everything. We paid all the bills. Bills have been delivered to your mailbox. Celebrity level lies. Can Yanni spent too much time out of the public eye? She's no longer a celebrity. While she lost access to any, uh, she goes to Oh my God. Erm, um, that is, I would say, unusual, but I suppose. Thank you. Who the hell said that? Oh, Ramel. That's unusual. We are one. Thank goodness Kiyani is a celebrity yeah. once again. <laughs> okay, so now she's back to being a celebrity. I'm crying. Okay, we're going to update our little profile. Okay, tell everyone, tell the world that we just gave birth to our baby. Like, yeah. And we're going to add to our Instagram story, too. He's such a good baby, y'all. Like, he really is not, like, fussy at all. Like, I was so surprised. Like, we've been up all night just trying to do stuff. Like, and he has not been fussy at all. Oh, he crying. We jinxed it, y'all. But I think Nyla going to wake up. Oh, he just crying for what? What he crying for? <laughs> it's like any time I come up. Okay, we gonna check the timeline. My baby, why are you crying for? Oh, this first Try and go night night. You don't wanna go night night. And she about to go get some potato chips instead of going for the baby. Like, you said you wanted to help, but you not helping. Okay, let me grab my child. Let's pick you up, okay? Nyla eating some ch <laughs> Black bean taco at 6 a.m. I mean, go off. That's what she's craving. You know, let's get some Starbucks. I want to get some Starbucks for real, for real. Do you really got to put them on the floor? Yeah. Bruh. She's like, that ain't my problem. Okay. She's such a terrible person. You about to be babysitting right now. You understand me? You about to be babysitting right now. Okay, I think he's getting a little hungry or what? He wants from being awake from too for too long. Okay, he wants to go to sleep. So we're gonna put him to sleep. Should we feed him before we leave though? I think we should feed my baby before we leave. We about to go and breastfeed him. Oh, okay. Come on, my baby. We gonna breastfeed you before we go to our dentist appointment. Okay. We gonna breastfeed you. Huh? You don't want to do it? Okay, he doesn't want no milk, yeah. He doesn't want no milk, okay. Let's go and put him to sleep. 
He a cranky baby. Never mind. I take it back. <laughs> she got to use the bathroom. She's hungry. She is tired. My poor girl. Okay, we're going to put him to bed. And kiss him. Oh, she's like, I'll see you soon. Dad got booty all up in her face. <laughs> okay, so we're going to start our dentist appointment. We're going to go to the dentist. But let's go use the bathroom. And we're going to change our outfit. And then Nyla is going to be the one to stay here. And she's obviously going to live the life up because she don't got to do much. She literally just gonna, you know. It's just Auntie Nyla and Prince for today. He is asleep. He is getting hungry though. Good thing that we did a little bit of pumping, y'all. Okay, we should have left a little notebook saying what we what she needs to do while we gone. <laughs> I keep forgetting to put a radio in here. The dentist has found that Kayani has got Gum disease. The dentist recommends can you brush more regularly and use a gum disease fighting mouthwash. Are you kidding me? She didn't even brush her teeth today. She nasty. Anyways, Kayani went in her little pajamas. She back from the dentist. We need to get us um <laughs> gum disease. Like so, gum disease. What is it called? Mouthwash, Listerine, a little drill. Is that what it's called? Mouthwash. <laughs> use this mouthwash. Yeah, use that. Just <laughs> <laughs> giving her the giggles and everything. Let's go to sleep. Ona. Ona. Go. Yeah, I think I want to end this episode right here. We had Prince, y'all. Look at his little cute self. He's just so adorable, so cute, so precious. But if y'all enjoyed this episode, let me know in the comments down below. Let me know anything else you guys think about this episode, any suggestions, anything you want to see in the next parts or the next future parts let me know i love y'all so 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 much and i hope you guys all enjoyed it and also go and check out my patreon so y'all can see the full birth and everything of mr princeton because he's definitely gonna be a prince all right in this town you understand me yeah so yeah i love y'all and i'll talk to you guys in the next one bye